Hey guys, Bing here. Today I'm going to talk about. Um, so the first one I'm going to talk about is how to install the correct uh, Revit content. Okay. So the second one I'm going to talk about the sample file folder in your Revit content. Okay. So let's start. So first, if if you open family, if here if you open family, um, you will see your Revit content. Okay, here I because I'm in Australia, so I have this Australia river content. So um, I'm not too sure about the difference between different uh, river content, but uh, not only I think not only the names are different. So for example, these one. So this door, there will be a bracket AUS. There must be a reason for this. Okay, and also uh, there might be some you know. Uh, for example, we will uh, have some special family in Australian one. Maybe uh, I guess um, maybe we will have some you know this special family only appears only appears in Australian content, but I don't know much. But the one I know is um, if you go. So for example, structure framing. Still, if you are using the Australian content, so you will have this folder. So for example, Australian standard folder. And if you go into this one, and all these families, are uh, all the size, all the name, all the type, they are um, to Australian standard. Okay, so this is the. So yeah, it's easier to use them because you know you can match the name, match the size to a uh, structure engineer's document. Okay, so that's so. Uh, what if if you don't have the the this uh Revit family, or you have the wrong one, you can you can just go. So I'll just quickly show you. Okay, so new. Search Autodesk Rev Content. Okay, and uh, I think probably just click on this one, and then you can just click on this download and type in a version. So uh, I'll say 2020, and then here, so we have this Autodesk uh, 2020 content. I'll just click on this one, and then, so you can see there there are all the you know different different ones for different countries. So for example, uh, I'm in Australia, so of course I'll download Australia one. Yeah. So yeah. So that's it. Um, yeah. Once you finish download and uh, just install it, and then you will have that all those folder. Okay, so now the next one. So I'm going to talk about this sample file folder. Okay, so and uh, so if you open family, so here I'm going to uh, so I, I use open family first. Okay, so because that's usually what we do when we're trying to open a family or load a family, and then so this one sample file, and when I open it, there's nothing. Um, that's correct because these sample file they are RVT file they are Revit file they are project they are not RFA they are not family so we need to go open models see they are here so I'll I'll quickly go through all these uh, sample files okay so first one fence. Um, fans, different fans. They are all rating, all good. So have a look, and uh, maybe next time if you need it, copy Control C, Control V to your project. Okay, so the next one, ratings. Um, very similar ratings. They can be fans. It can be uh, this uh, canopy kind of thing. 
um, waiting. So yeah, so if we need them, just copy and paste. Yep. And also, if you want to model something like this, you can always edit type and they just have a look through all the setting. Okay, so that's mailings. So the next one will be repeating details. So they are useful when you need to uh, detail your drawing, like uh, for your detail, for your sections. So the same, just copy and paste, and then you can use use them in your project. Okay, so that's it. The next one will be roof form. So this one, I think this one's quite useful. Just go through each one, so and. Uh, have a look of each one and then you will understand how uh, to model this shape so in a um, you know effective quite like a so for example this one so instead of have two so you can just you add a slope arrow and then so just create it as one same as this one and uh, all this need to be separate roof just have a look at these and how. So for example, you need to use these. How? Yep. Oh, I think I broke it. Anyway, let's try again. Nope. Hmm. Oh, no idea. Anyway, let's control Z. Control Z. Yep. Okay, so yeah, all different. These are extrusion, extrusion, extrusion. So same as that one. And what's this one? Ah, oh, simple. So this will be model in place. Uh, revolve. This one will be revolve. This one will be a sweep. Yep. So yeah. This ball is quite good, so have a look. So, and it will tell you how to model roofs. Okay, so next one <coughs> roof types. Uh, okay, these are just different types of roof, and then you can have a look of all you know the structure, all the materials, and if you need. To just copy and paste in your project. Okay, so last one, stairs. Yep, all different type, different material, different setting, and some, yep. Good. Yeah, so if you need if you need these, just copy and paste into your project. Because all these um Railing, railing, uh, stairs, roof. So they are uh, they are system family. I think are they system family? So you can't save them as one uh, you know single family and load them into a project. So you can only control C and control V into your project. Okay. So that's it for today. Um, just we just talk, talked about um, how to install the correct Revit content, and once you have that Revit content, there's a simple file folder. You can just have a look, and uh, you will. Uh, yeah, it's it, it will be useful, I believe. Okay, so that's it. Um, uh, actually, not today's Christmas. Happy Christmas, uh, Merry Christmas everyone, um, I'll see you tomorrow, bye.